circus today, man. It's crazy. Oh! I could have been in the AC. You know what? That's what makes life fun. You know what I'm saying? All right, I'm unloading this skid steer because we're going to pull paper pallets out and all that stuff. I got Wiley with me. He's going to boss me around all day today. What's up, buddy? What's going on? How you about you, Josh? We in? I do. Yeah, that's crazy, isn't it? Slung, slung that trailer forward a little bit there. Well, what happened was... <laughs> See what happened, Will. So we got a cool video for you guys today. We're gonna get loaded. We're gonna get this stuff unloaded, get moved around, do a bunch of stuff. I don't know if you saw the other video, but we've made a video. The best thing you can do uh, to help the channel out is to give us a like and to watch more videos. That really helps us out. That sends a big signal to YouTube. If you got 20 minutes after you watch this one, please go check out another Hamiltonville farm video. That really helps us out a lot. We'd appreciate it. But uh, I don't know if you can see, but there's three trucks over there that are piggybacked on each other. And that's the project we've been working on. But uh, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun. We're gonna get this stuff. We're just playing Tetris at this point with some of this stuff, ain't we? Yeah, so, what's Tetris? <laughs> that's a game them young kids play. Oh. I wonder if I can take his door off. I'm gonna take his door off. I wonder if I can do that. I mean, you can, but I wonder if the, if the Dumaflachi has to be shut to, for the controls to work. I'll check it out later. The problem is, my a I got an AC in this thing, but man, I'm telling you, if, unless you stick your hand right in the vent, it doesn't blow very cold. But enough of that. Let's uh, get it off the. Let's get it off the trailer. Take his door off. Huh? I said I'm gonna take his door off. All right. All right. Because I, I want to be able to talk to you more. Thanks. <laughs> I'm thinking this uh, furniture here is probably. We just had a skid steer operator. <laughs> yeah, dude, let me take this door off right quick. It won't take me five minutes. Three hours later. So, Wiley. Yay. The other day, my wife said, is it me or is this cat looking really fat? And evidently, the right answer is not. It's just you. <laughs> really too early in the morning. Is it too early in the it's morning? too early in the morning. It's too soon. Too soon. Too soon. Well, maybe when we're tired and we're not thinking right, that would be funny. <laughs> there we go. I thought that was it. I get this gas shock off here like that. There you go. Wiley. Yeah, don't mess up that door. <laughs> I don't think you can. What am I doing when I pull this off the trailer? We're going to set this kind of to the side. Tenfold. And we'll probably wind up carrying it somewhere All right. in it probably. Sounds good. Would be my assumption.
Watch it. Right. Right. You tell them about the door coming back. Good chair. I got a big old wash nest on that sucker. This trailer right here, I believe it was a 1977 Dorsey trailer built in Elba, Alabama. Dorsey trailers? Dorsey trailer. Back when trailers was built, it's just a 48 footer. Oh yeah. All right. So you know why they were built like 48 foot? Huh? Back, you know, people ask about cab overs and long nose and all that stuff. Yeah. Yep. The government regulated the length uh, of the tractor trailer combo. And so. Oh, God, at the desk. Woo. I don't know why in the world you didn't come out here and unload this before you got here. Man, I'm telling you. We should at least come at night. I don't know. We got, I got up at 6 o'clock this morning. It was, hum it was still just as humid as it can be. I got some of it now. All right, yep. Go. I think the rest of it with the. I can probably stick my fork in there. Okay. Come over here and fork it. <laughs> Hank and Wiley moving services. If we can't ship it, we'll break it. That's for sure. I bet you're wondering how we're going to get those pallets, aren't you? How are we going to get the pallets? Yeah. What we're going to do, we're going to build a ramp, and you're going to... <laughs> okay. <laughs> and go. <laughs> you know they build something for this, don't you? They do? Yeah. I never... What do you mean? Like a jig of some sort or something? Like something. 
flight or for real. Awesome. I hope I, yeah, I got two chains. That's 40 foot. We got plenty of chains. Yeah. How about that? Oh, man. So grab her. Looks like a, uh, looks like a logging skitter thing. You know how they skid it? Uh, what do they call those? It looks nothing like a grapple. No, like, uh, like some tongs of some sort. Yeah, I, oh, yeah. Yeah. That's what they're called. Log tongs. Yeah. Let me get my phone just in case the other truck is called. Okay. Tong to tong tong tongs. <laughs> where am I taking this when I unload it? We're gonna j probably just set it out there where you can get back to it. And, okay. Oh. Uh, load today, bringing a box truck. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Here we go. Here we go. That's too much weight, it won't go. <laughs> that might be the funniest thing you said. <laughs> That's gonna be the funniest thing y'all hear in the video today. All right? Not want me to get it so close next time? No. Oh.
My bad. Need a change. How many more rows do we have? I just like twelve more pallets. Cause I've got a I've got a ten foot chain. Now we're gonna need them all. Okay. Oh yeah, you talking about the ten foot after we use this forty? I got you. Well, I got to look. My ten foot's only got. I mean, we'll have it if it's a, if we need it, you know. Yeah. Yeah, we could have been doing this with the TYM. I well, could have been in the AC. Man, I thanks for thinking would. of me, Wally. I wish we would have, Hank. <laughs> that way, me and. <laughs> didn't have to hear it. <laughs> I could use a short chain before you get back up there, Hank. All right. The 10 foot would be great. All right, 10 foot. Come on, Overcast. This has been a fun project, this whole, we've done the RV here, Wiley's done a bunch of will it starts on here. We've done the Mac. It's been a it's been a good place. I'm sure I'm proud. Cameraman didn't see me getting up here. <laughs> Dude, you should have just waited. We got you know 12 point <laughs> contact. <laughs> then rolled. Why is the back of your shirt all dirty? Because I rolled in. <laughs> you Actually, somebody that wants to sell some equipment. I uh, I need to put some fuel on this thing after this one. Huh? I I need to put fuel in this thing. Did I? Did, is my fuel tanks? Yeah, I got I got five gallons on. No, dude, I got it. Hook it to itself and then. Please, just watch. That's totally not how I would have done it. I know. <laughs> You'll see once, once I, it gets done, Hank. It's, it's kind of like our videos. Once they get done, people go, oh, <laughs> I see what they're doing now. Yeah. They didn't have to do that, but. Okay. All right, ready? Yeah. You want to swap? Let me do that. You do this. That's good. You sure? I need to exercise.
yourself. Watch this. Watch yourself. You do this. Got it, bro. This starts bucking, so just be careful on the throttle. Go ahead, I'll get Ooh. you. I did get some air. There we go. Oh, it's all the way to the back. Two, four, six, eight. Eight more? Nine. Three, five, nine. Piece cake. Six. <laughs>
You all right? Back, just a little towards. Uh, actually, let me get these off first. I got them. I got it. Hey, you didn't get hit, did you? Darn. <laughs> Touch it. Welcome to the Wiley School of Forklift Operation. You'll grab another pallet, we'll set it on top. You hit this pallet, kicked it over. You'll put another pallet here, and I'll set this pallet on top of the other pallet. Come on. Oh. oh boy. <laughs> that's what, that's what, uh, oh, I see what it is now. Oh. That's what depth perception will do for you. Or lack of depth perception. <laughs> that right there might be the only thing. It... Okay, so I'm going to pick this up and scoot it back. It's messed up anyway, just go.
Glad I had this with me because I didn't check the fuel before I left. But it shouldn't take. We've only got seven more cases. This is this is a, a little more challenging than when I thought. <laughs> I tell you what's fun though. The fun part is you get to do this stuff. I mean, who gets to unload a trailer full of paper with the skid steer every day? Not me. Whew. Wiley about killed himself. Bless his heart. It's just so hot and tired. Airflow in that trailer. I wonder what the real temp is out here. I would say it's in the. I would say it's triple digits. Got to be a hundred. 102. <laughs> Hope you need some copying paper too. <laughs> I'm not sure my my, T, my TYM would have been hurt, would have been hurting on that. I think because that you know so heavy in the back end. Yeah. So what you're saying now you've changed your mind again. Basically, you know what I'm saying is we could have brought the TYM in that and you could have piped the air conditioner <laughs> <laughs> like duck work follows you around. Heck yeah. As you can imagine, there's just no wind in there. No, I know. Pulling the chain ain't hard. Yeah. He's going to sit in there. They got pallet jacks that'll move it back yeah. and forth. And a lot younger guy. So we can set it right there on the edge and you don't have to worry about it. All right. <laughs>
That's good. We, we got two more in there. Do what? See what I'm talking about? Yeah, I do. And those pallets are wet. I think they'll. I think it'll mess up without the giving it a chance. What if they pop off? Well, hopefully if I go slow enough, we'll figure it out. Me and my precision work. Yeah. Let's try it. If it starts to bend a little bit, we'll stop. Going backwards. Step on that track. Pallet jack. Gonna load them on here? Uh, no, I was just going to. I could be using air compressor on what else we're gonna do. The big truck arrived, so we put the pallet, uh, paper, the pallets of paper in there. But check this out. Wiley's making that video for his channel, so we was over there helping him. Now I'm gonna go unload this. I mean, it's a circus today, man. It's crazy what's going on out here. But you know what? That's what, my, that's what makes life fun. You know what I'm saying? So he'll finish up over there because those guys are waiting. I'll come over here, finish loading up these guys, and we'll we'll call it good. It has been. I don't know what time it is, probably 12 o'clock. We got here at 9 o'clock. But it's only like 9,000 degrees, so that's awesome. All right. Hey, what I'll do, hey, if, if you want, we'll go ahead and get loaded. Or we'll take the pallet jack out. All right. Let's we'll get in there and start down where you are. Uh-oh. He shouldn't have cut it off. <laughs> I don't think he meant to. <laughs> oh, no. Dylan, get in there and slide them to the back. Stack what you can on top of it and get them ready. Hey, bring it up. Yeah. I don't know if that uh, fuel pump is going out or what. Let me, I'll, uh... Yeah, we got one of those. 
So that's good. That's the easiest thing you've ever had. But I'm telling you. And the empty pallets are going to Wiley? Yeah, Wiley wanted them. Oh, okay. Oh, he must be selling them or something. If he's selling them, I'm going to charge him for them. <laughs> <laughs> Pallet business, big business from what I understand. Making all that furniture stuff. <laughs> hey, listen, my wife made a whole outdoor grill with some pallets one time. Pinterest is the devil, man. It make you do all kind of crazy stuff. <laughs> yeah. All right, let me, you want me to unload those? Is that what you want to do? Yeah. All Those last two pallets are they've got a lip on them and we couldn't pull them out. And my skid steer, if you run it high throttle, the thing it's like a mechanical bull, man. Really? Young boy's been helping us up there. I got I told him, I said, get in the skid steer and I got a 320. Yeah. And I said, he said, what's this pedal? I said, that's your gas pedal. I said, you ain't gotta do it throttle. I said, I use the gas. Yeah. So he goes back and tells, it's Michael Jackson up there. Yeah. He said, you mean to tell me that's the throttle down there? I said, tell him, yeah, this is a 16-year-old boy. He said, yeah, tell him you didn't know that. He said, I've had skinny here 10 years, I didn't know that. Yeah, buddy.
Okay. right there. So you got a two. We'll be back with that pickup. We'll sit that one on in there. And okay. And All right. I appreciate it. Yeah, man, of course. So we got two pallets left. We got a full pallet and a half pallet left to load. So the guy took his pickup truck. He's dropping it off. Here he comes now. But I was coming over here to check, see if Wiley needed any help. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and load him up with a pallet and a half and uh, finish helping Wiley make his video. Don't, go to, Don't Be Wiley is the channel. I'm gonna get also. I'm also gonna get a bottle of water.
Yeah, I was going to give it to my church. Okay, yeah, take that. Take okay. that pallet with you. All right, then we shall. Thank you. Appreciate it. Well, can we buy some air out of your compressor? Uh, yeah, sure. What do you need? I need a little in that tire, I think. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they're using it over there, but we can definitely. Just, can you get? Can you make it that far? Or do I need to bring the truck over no, here? I can make it. Then I uh -huh. Ten. Okay, okay. Thank you, sir. Yeah, yeah. Appreciate. It. Always good to see y'all. Yes, sir. I'm gonna go back to the truck. Listen, we're done. I know this was like the most exciting video you ever seen. Wiley's over there finishing up his video. We're over here fixing to load up the skid steer. Man, I tell you, we get into some crazy stuff. Watch another video from Hamiltonville Farm. We'd truly appreciate it. You guys take care. God bless.